Hello friends hope you all are doing good my name is Parth and welcome to my channel my ride my review today we'll be talking about the certain things which i wish mahindra did differently in their recently launched scorpio n the vehicle that you see in front of me is uh, in green color and it's a petrol manual model hence you can see the sizes of the wheels is smaller it's 17 inch This vehicle has a lot of craze in the industry right now and people are visiting the showroom just to get a test drive and I'm very sure that it will be selling like hotcakes but I wish there are certain things which I which Mahindra did differently so let's get started the first thing is the steering wheel you can see that it's only tilt adjustable there is no telescopic so it's very inconvenient i wish that telescopic adjustment was also there then you can see here the irvm which has to be controlled manually and it's not automatic also you can see the clutch pedal here you have to press it a longer and then it goes deep and uh, there is a chance that you might stall the vehicle if you are not accustomed the dead pedal you can see that you have to lift your leg a lot just to press the clutch pedal again also the glove box you can see that it's very flimsy and very shallow it's cool but uh, it's very shallow and underneath the glove box you can see this electrical equipment which are very exposed it should have been hidden another thing is uh, the you know support thigh support uh, my height for your reference is 59 and you can see the thigh support is not much i wish it was better than that the uh, you know the comfort in the seat could have been better moving on and uh, you can see the body panel are made of uh, perhaps better still but uh, i was able to push it and then you know it was going inside and also you can see uh, the real door which uh, i it felt like it's made of plastic and i wish uh, it was of uh, you know harder material or better or perhaps still and once you open the door you can see that the boot space is uh, very less with all the three rows up and then you hardly get any boot space and also you can see that the third row seat is not 50 50 split you just get one bench and then it tumbles forward to give the you know boot space here the bad thing about the boot space here is uh, it's not even you get this hump here and uh, it's not a flat bed so the usability of the boot space though being huge is uh, you know compromised here also i could see there are uh, fit and finish issues here as you can see and this could have been done differently this vehicle was a six seater vehicle and uh, this uh, being a tall vehicle i wish that uh, the grab rails were given in the you know side side or b pillar uh, to make it more convenient to enter the vehicle so now you have to grab the uh, holders uh, grab holders here to get inside once you get inside you see that uh, the front row is uh, and the gap is is providing good enough space for the second row people and uh, i i i wish the thigh support was better in the uh second row seat as well these are captain seats and i wish this were more comfortable additionally you can see the magazine holder uh here is very shallow and you get a phone holder there but uh, it's it's very less usable there is a scoop in the front seat to provide more leg space also the ac vents are at knee height and uh, uh, you know those are not very practical to have additionally they don't throw the air to the third row i am seated here in the third row the leg space the knee space is horrible and i am sitting in a new knee upright uh, position is very uncomfortable here there is a hump uh, where i am not able to you know place my foot uh, in a better comfortable position so it's very inconvenient to sit in the uh, third row also you can see the head space is uh, not good enough hardly 1 inch of it it feels very claustrophobic 
and only recommended for children also there is no cup holders you can see this one panel where you have a one phone hold holder only provided to you the headlight uh, is also made of plastic uh, panel here and uh, these are the certain things which i wish that uh, you know mahindra did differently it's a very good vehicle personally i like the vehicle the design and the stance of it but uh, still i wish uh, those things could have been rectified hope you enjoyed the video please do subscribe the channel thank you so much for tuning in